Hi there, this is uh, Mario Roberto with the Mario Roberto Jiu-Jitsu Academy, and uh, we're here to teach you the technique of the week for MinnesotaMMANews.com. And uh, today we're going to cover the basic Thai switch kick to his leg here. Uh, so in this kick here, since I'm, I fight right-handed, I'm going to be using my left leg. And the number one concern here is to place the target in the correct position. So if I'm in line, if I'm fighting uh, Dan here, and I'm in line with his hips, what happens here is that it's very hard for me to commit the hip if I'm kicking to the leg. What I mean by that is that once I kick here, the hips are not passing through the target. And that's the key to the power with a tie kick. Now that we're talking about tie kicks, it's always important to remember that the path needs to be as horizontal as possible or sometimes even downward. And when I kick to the leg, it's really not, for this sort of kick, good for me to have an upward path. All right? So I'm going to get the target and place the target right in the middle of my leg. So how do I do that? As I move right now, this target, if I draw a line, is cutting me in half. And this is the good position now for me to kick. So I'm kicking up. My hands are relaxed. You don't want to be making a fist all the time. And there are a few ways. Now that I have, I'm using a left leg to kick, I don't want to kick by keeping this leg up front. I always want to kick with the leg that's in the back. So I got to do something here to switch stances to southpaw for a fraction of a second. There are a couple of things that I can do here, a couple of ways of get that, getting that accomplished. One way is what's called a switch step. So basically, a switch step is a fast step that you do here, where now I got my lead leg, it's no longer the lead, it's in the back, in the power position here, so I can generate some force. So I'm right here, here, right? Now it's ready to rock. The other thing that I can do here is from a longer distance, I can cut it with 45 degree steps. So I can take a step with the lead leg 45 degrees, take a step with the back leg 45 degrees, and now I'm ready to execute the kick. Always important, we're not kicking with our foot here, we're kicking with our shin, and higher on the shin here. So I want this surface to land on his thigh, never the foot. If I kick something like a shield here with my foot, I'm going to break my toes. So we're right here, going to take that step, either, you know, the 45s or, you know, the switch step, and we get to this position. When I get to this position, important things to keep in mind. I need to spike this foot here, because if I'm flat footed on the ground, once I start kicking, there's a lot of drag, there's a lot of surface contact with the mat. So it slows me down. I'm burning energy there, burning heat. I don't want that. So get your, the ball of your foot here, so when you pivot, you're going to be able to have a lot more speed and power. The leg swings like a piece of dead weight, like a baseball bat, like a piece of metal. I do not want to cock the leg like traditional martial arts and then execute a leg extension to kick. That does nothing for me. Might be worth a point in karate or taekwondo, but if you want to hurt somebody, you're kicking through them. So I want to hit a home run here. So the leg is not what it's all about. It's all about the hips here passing through. So switch, spike. Boom. Now, it doesn't matter how hard I kick if I bring my leg, my hands down, because I'm going to get clocked with something. So hands are always high. Not only they are high, but the hand that was in the lead comes back to act as a catch mitt. This hand here, two possibilities. I stay straight now, or I whip it back if I want a little bit more power. If I do whip it back, I want to make sure that my shoulder is covering the head. So here, switch. So here, switch, okay? Now if you don't want to do the 45 degrees, it would be 45 degrees, 45 degrees, 45 degrees, 45 degrees, 45, 45, right there. And that will be the basic switch kick for mixed martial arts. Check us out at www.mrjj.com or at www.minnesotammanews.com.